Good day, YouTubers. It's Bears again. Just going to show you what's actually happening with the uh, lighting on the shockwave. Um, I'm going to have actually two sets of lighting running. One is uh, going to be more for on the RGB bases, and the other one's just uh, pure white lighting for the case. Yeah, just to show you what I've um, got in mind to do. Um, as you can see, there's a there's a hub there for the first set of lighting. Uh, those will be for the white lighting and the RGB will be on of course that little controller over there as we can see. That controller will run the RGBs and that one will run the other lights which I think I've got one, two, three four or five of them all together so yep there's five spots there and all of those will be connected up to a power unit that comes out of the section over here which I'll just quickly show you what it looks like it's there from Case Labs that's their on and, on and reset button but in the two holes yeah, that you see that I've got now I'm going to be um, inserting some another two switches uh, which look like these yeah so yeah just getting back to the case I'll show you up yeah as you can see in there there's one strip of RGB lighting over there and uh, there's another one up there and there's another one inside this uh, area over here so those are the three RGBs that I'm having running and in that section there as you guys can see I hope the video is not too dark but um, that's one of the uh, dark side LEDs which I prefer using in my builds actually it's the only ones I will use in my builds from now on excellent stuff, good brightness to them and good quality, well sleeved as well I've got one in there and one in this section down here you'll see one inside there and the other one is in actual in actually the pedestal which is at the bottom of the pedestal uh, underneath the S, S8 metal section and I have, will have two under the motherboard which is already installed to the motherboard section I'll show you later guys how that looks Okay guys, let's just move to the wiring section quick. Uh, I received my in-source cables uh, about two weeks ago, so I decided to just show you guys quickly how I've got it installed into the PSU. Uh, all getting it in there, ready to go through to the midsection and top section of the case. Uh, I'm very happy with the quality and the finish of these wiring. As you can see, the GPU wiring, the 24-pin, absolutely well done job by them so I'm going to feed these through to the top section here uh, the mid section actually and then through to the top section I have to get the wiring all completed in the uh, pedestal so at least uh, I don't have to go back there and sort all that out so yeah it's really working by section by section but as you can see a little bit of a spaghetti at the moment but that will all get tidied up and set into place once uh, we get closer to the end there anyway guys once again thanks for watching uh, any questions yeah, leave a comment please click a like that helps me a lot in getting a few more views but yep as you know who I am that's me thank you very much for watching and see you on the next one eh?